Okay, so 420 is a pretty big festival here in Toronto, Canada. It's like a pretty big festival. It's a big parade. People, they really like it. They go out and they, you know, they enjoy the festivities and the sights. So today I'm going to go down. You know, I've never been to the 420 parade before. I'm going to go down there, check it out and see what it's like. And maybe we'll get some, maybe we will get some excellent shots. All right, let's check it out, guys. Disclaimer, very important. This is a travel video, travel video. We do not endorse the illegal usage or sale of marijuana. All things shown in this video are 100% legal in Canada, 100% legal. No laws were broken while filming and no violations were committed by the crew. Thank you, everybody, for watching. And be good. Well, time to start our adventure. Time to get on the train, the subway, the TTC. Any true Toronto man dem, his heartbeat sounds like the tracks of the TTC. Whenever I get on the subway, it always reminds me of back when I was in uni. Back when I was a college boy. You know, the sounds, the smells, they're all familiar, and one can't help but go towards a familiar, nostalgic feeling when faced with those sounds and smells. It's fantastic. There she is, the city, Toronto. It's beautiful. The speed, the busyness, even the underlying tone of mad desperation, the struggle against winter, against the elements, the push to survive. The city that never stops, the lights, the speed of the cars rushing by, everything is beautiful. I feel, I feel the pollution, I feel the busyness, I feel the craziness, I feel the passion, the industry of the city pumping through my veins. It's fantastic. Right about here, I started to worry. All the sirens, all the firemen, police, ambulances. It's getting kind of crazy. But then I saw these guys working on the building that was supposed to be on fire. So I just went back to my day, and that was pretty good. After all, we had a 420 to get to. We had a festival, a parade to see. We had a festival to see. We had a whole city to see and a whole day ahead of us. Let's get back to it. Alright, we're getting close. We're here. We're at Young and Dundas Square. You know, I've never had a churro. I have never had a churro. And here we have the big obtuse library. It's crazy. All the strange architecture and cool buildings, and there it is, the Eaton Center, the downtown core. We're getting close. Man, I haven't seen a crowd like this in a very long time. I used to work before all the craziness, such big crowds all the time. So I felt some comfort, kind of felt at home. But I still social distanced. I still kept my mask on. That doesn't mean we can't have some fun. Can't look at a festival. Look at that. That's absolutely fantastic. There's over a thousand people here. There's a lot of people. And they're not clogging the rest of the city. They're being very polite. Very well-mannered. And organized. 
it's very Canadian. It's fantastic. There's so many sights and sounds, the lights, the craziness. Look at all these people. <laughs> Look at them there. They each have their own story, snaking off in every direction. It's really great. There it is. Maybe after I'll go in and get some food or we'll figure out what we're going to do. But it's getting close to 420 at 420 and everybody's gathering. And that's pretty crazy. We've got, we've got every type of person here. And it's 420 at 420. And all these people are having a great time. Look at me laughing and smiling away. But at this point, I think I'm getting pretty hungry. It's the Believe guy. I just got blessed. And this is really starting to look like a great, absolutely great day. I had a great time at the festival. I'm seeing all sorts of wonderful sights. Now it's time to get some food. You know, I always wanted to try Jollibee. So let's check this out. You know, the drink is normal so far. And this guy dancing right here, he's got some kind of serious energy. Alright, let's look at this chicken right here. It seems to have some sort of spicy seasoning on it. It's good. I like it. It came with mashed potatoes. I like mashed potatoes. Mashed potatoes. Alright, back in the city. We're out here. We're having a great time. And we've got some more sights to see. And anyways, we got some nerd stuff to do. You know that's always the best kind of day. And this pigeon right here is the spirit animal of Toronto. Alright, I got to my magic card tournament, and this is gonna be fun. I couldn't resist. I, I couldn't resist. Get in a uh, quick game, get my promo card, and go home. You know what I mean. It's a great day. Now, I want to get some Chinese buns from the Chinese bakery. Look at the variety. There's so many crazy flavors. <laughs> but me, I like the basic custard bun. It's sweet. It's simple. Oh, it's so good. It reminds me a little bit of a Boston cream donut. Hey, Boston cream. Or... Well, it's good. I like it. Now, time to get on home, but it's just such a beautiful day. Sometimes, when you have a really good day, it's like, you know, you just want it to keep going. You want to do more fun stuff, but it's time for me to head home. Check out this art. It's pretty cool. Some birds, some patchki. I like it. I like all the architecture, the subtlety versus the drama, and just the buildings around me. <laughs> and seeing everybody run, I like running, so it makes me want to get up and run. There's the museum. What a great building. Man, I really think it was a good day, and I did see a lot of awesome cool stuff. And the Jollibee was pretty good. So, that's good. I don't always get to... I don't always get to eat junk food. So I'm happy when I get to. And the city is just so beautiful. Especially on such a nice day like today. I hope spring's finally sprung. And, you know, I hope you guys all had... I hope you guys all had a happy 420. And hit that subscribe button down below. And thank you so much for watching, everybody. And I hope you guys have a great day. Bye, everybody.